Oh, well, uh, hi, my name is Ned, and um, this is Quick Facts 2, part 2. So, uh, if you haven't watched the part 1, which have uh, very important facts uh, about the Android operation system, um, you can see it. And uh, if you like it, uh, step to part 2. So, uh, here are the next uh, four quick quick facts. So, uh, the quick, five, quick fact uh, number, number 5. Well, uh, it's not about um, it's not about uh, some hardware limitations. Uh, it's it's some kind of software limitations uh, for now. So uh, I have to point that uh, these are temporary issues, but uh, they are going uh, almost a month, and uh, nobody knows uh, when they are going to be resolved. So um, when you have an Android phone, uh, you probably have. Uh, if you have G1, you you are certainly have an. Um, and market so uh, an Android market from where you can install uh, apps so uh, there are very problems with uh, with this application and with the whole uh, service from Google so uh, please Google I know that uh, you're working on it and we're all waiting but uh, please uh, tell us more information and uh, more information about, about the problems so uh, because uh, we don't know um, what causes them and how to prevent them so uh, I'm talking about certain problems so uh, from time to time uh, you uh, you aren't uh, you won't be able to to download and install uh, certain applications I don't know why so uh, you can ask Google but um, they uh, they don't answer such questions. They they just say oh, we're working we're working on a problem, and uh, I hope they do. But uh, these problems uh, are very irritating. So uh, sometimes uh, the application just stands still on the notification bar uh, here on notification bar and uh, says downloading, but uh, it shows only zero uh, percent percent and uh, you actually um, can't download the app. There are other problems with the paid apps so you have to have uh, you have to uh, get an account from from Google and check out and uh, they accept only uh, Visa and uh, MasterCard so there were some problems in UK uh, some users were very angry uh, because they don't have uh, Visa and MasterCard but uh, they still want to to buy apps and uh, they they ca they can't do that at this point. Um, so only Visa and Mastercard are, are allowed, uh, as far as I know, till now. And um, so uh, please don't blame the developers when you when you pay for app and uh, it doesn't uh, download. So uh, it's not their problem. It's uh, market's problem so don't blame them they uh, can't do anything uh, to to fix it but um, in in my case uh, i don't have uh, much problems about the about installing apps i have uh, this problem it occurs to me only uh, five or six times and uh, now I, I don't have such problem but from the from the market help i see i see topics uh, uh, it, the market is flooded with uh, such topics about uh, this problem, so uh, you you should know that uh, there are still some problems with, with the system. So, uh, quick fact number six is uh, that uh, the sound quality uh, of this particular handset uh, G1 or ADP1 isn't uh, so so loud. So uh, it's very irritating uh, when uh, an, an incoming call is in progress. And uh, you don't hear it. Well, uh, here is the here is the speaker. Here is the speaker. Um, and uh, when you place the phone like this, and uh, you almost can't hear the the sound from the melody you choose. So uh, even to the to the maximum, it's uh, hardly to hear. But uh, for me, this isn't a big uh, a big problem. But um, I must point it out, like uh, hardware or software flow. Uh, and um, the other thing, which which I don't know uh, if it's on uh, certain uh, versions of the of the firmware, but uh, when you receive a call, when you receive a call, uh, the display stays uh, still black, and you have to wait uh, five or six seconds until uh, you see who's calling you. 
but uh, I don't know if this is a major issue and uh, I don't know if it's only uh, in, in my phone but it's probably not but I hope that it will be resolved so uh, stay tuned for the next major update which we are all waiting Android 1.5 the formal cupcake so uh, the quick fact number 7 is um, that uh, there is no uh, Bluetooth support uh, when we're talking about uh, sending files from one phone to another or from phone to another uh, Bluetooth enabled device. So um, it's not a big deal for me. Uh, even iPhone doesn't support it. I don't know why. I don't know why uh, any cool smartphone like uh, Android and uh, Palm Pre and uh, iPhone. Uh, I don't know why that, why they did, why they don't support uh, such uh, such service. But uh, with these phones, you you, you can't uh, send files uh, via Bluetooth. So I don't know why. Maybe there are some security issues. Maybe uh, Google, Apple, and so on don't want to uh, expose these phones. But uh, you can't. So you must know about this and the the last quick fact from this series is uh, that there is no but you probably know it in G1 and in the future G2 there is no 3.5 uh, jack for um, for audio so uh, you must listen from this 11 pin HTC uh, USB port and uh, you have to buy a converter from from this mini USB to uh, to 3.5 uh, audio jack. And uh, well, this uh, is not a big problem, but uh, you have to know about about this limitation. So uh, don't get me wrong. Uh, from fact 1 to fact uh, 8, I, uh, I was talking all about uh, negative stuff, about, uh, about missing futures uh, and uh, s about limitations, but uh, this is not uh, the whole picture about uh, this uh, operation system Android. It's really cool, uh, it's really reliable, it's really uh, fast and responsive. They are very, very good futures which uh, for now you can't find in the in the older versions operating systems like Windows Mobile, uh, Palm and uh, even uh, the iPhone operation system well here are certain features which you can find them there and they're pretty cool um, you also have a uh, free megapixel camera which uh, makes uh, a decent uh, pictures when you're outside and uh, there are many futures, many few cool futures, but uh, I'll make some uh, other videos about them. But uh, I wanted to show you first the, the negative futures because uh, when you buy a new phone and when you uh, when you think that uh, well, I'll buy a G1 and I'll install apps on the SD card, I'll listen music with my uh, cool uh, headsets, uh, I'll send files uh, through my uh, Bluetooth and uh, I won't have any problems with my market, uh, with the Android market, I won't have uh, any problems with my battery, it will last uh, weeks and so on and uh, you understand that uh, actually you can't install apps on the SD card, uh, you, you certainly or uh, well there is a possibility that you will have problems with the market and with the payment methods and that the battery uh, isn't so strong and um, well, you, know, you can get a little bit disappointed, but uh, when you know about these advantages before you buy a device and you say, well, hell no, there are, uh, I know about these disadvantages, but uh, I know about the cool futures and I'll buy this phone, well, um, you won't be disappointed since you, you already knew about these um, this missing futures. So in the next videos, uh, I'll, I'll talk about the, the cool features in the Android system, the new features which are coming into the Android 1.5, which is the formal uh, cupcake. And uh, I hope uh, I see you soon, so thanks for watching and uh, have a nice day.